Hello guys, welcome to today's video tutorial by Trust Stanley at TS Tech Top. Today guys, I want to show you how to create an animated um, GIF moji, Bitmoji and remove the background. So um, if you notice on my previous video, I showed you guys how to create um, animated Bitmoji but um, I was displaying my laptop then. So on this video, I want to show you guys how to create an animated Bitmoji and then remove the background. And this is what we'll be using. We'll be using a plain paper. Just have a plain paper by your side and have anything that will support the plain paper. So for me, I have a plain paper and I have I have um, a phone to use to support the plain paper so that it will be able to stand and I'll be able to record the Bitmoji. So, and also make sure you have your snipe tag installed like I did on the previous video. So the same thing I did on the previous video is what I'm going to do now. Just click to open your Snapchat and once the camera is on, you can notice this is my plain paper and if you see, um, it's I need to use a blank area so that I wouldn't be recording um, I wouldn't be recording a an area with blue blueberry so that it won't be difficult to edit the background. So I have to make it blank and I have to support it with a cell phone. So I'm going to pause this video to set that up. All right, so I think this is good to go. You can see the way I set it up just um, below and I have something that supported it. So you can do yours like that too. Find something to support it behind and then make sure you are displaying it on full screen. Just the white paper to display anyway. Then once it's displaying, go ahead and look for the um, lens that you want to make use of. Let me use any one for this video. You guys should also do the same. So you can see the only the smurf is showing and I think I'm okay with this. And I'm going to wait for it to turn around and then start recording. So there you go. <laughs> Okay, complete. So let's see. All right, I'm okay with this. Let me go ahead and save it so it will be saved on the device. And let me confirm if it's saved already. Let me check my videos. And it's saved. I think I'm okay with this. So um, next thing, let's go ahead and open this particular app. So to remove the background, you can make use of two things. Either you make use of this web app or you make use of um, your laptop to remove the background. Then I'm going to show you guys two ways to do this. I'm going to use Camtasia and I'm also going to use an online system to do this. Now, um, I'm going to show you, I'm going to tell you the two different what um, they does actually so you understand. Now, let me go ahead and click um, open the site. The site URL is actually on screen. Go ahead and type on screen like, like this onscreen.com i'm going to leave the link on the description below so that you guys will easily click on it so go ahead and upload the video to remove the background then click on upload clip and then go to where you have it saved and this is it so click on it and wait for it to upload depending on how fast your internet is it depends on how fast it's going to upload and after it upload it's going to render and remove the background and sometimes it might not be perfect and it might not be accurate so you guys should bear with it depending on how clear your video are but i think this one is looking a bit accurate so far so guys the difference between this one and the other one is some there are some um, video editors there are some um, video editors that you can import this to because after this removes the background it's going to save it as a gif and there are some video editors that you can import GIF to. So the only way you can export this is to export it as a GIF. That's after it finished. You can download it, but you should note that it only downloads at GIF or it will download at um, animated um, PNG. So just go ahead and download it as a GIF. If you download it as a GIF, you can go ahead and upload it as a GIF anywhere. And also you can change it to green screen and upload. So after downloading this you can download another app to convert to from gif to video and all those stuffs it will still work it will you'll be able to import it on your video but it won't look as clear as it is but i'm still going to show you guys how to convert it anyway let me go ahead and show you while it upload okay it started downloading okay the download is complete now you can see the download let's check it out now you can see 
it's transparent but it's not very perfect you can notice the glass area and the side are not very perfect so if you're okay with this you can make use of it uh anywhere and also you can make use of it in your video but it's not all video editor that accepts it so i'm going to go ahead to show you guys which um um the way you can do this on your laptop also all right so now on the laptop i'm just going to go ahead and open my favorite um, um video editor if you have any video editor of choice you can go ahead and make use of it as you wish actually if you are using adobe premiere pro i think you can use that gif image there will be no need for you editing it on on your video editor but um i use camtasia and camtasia doesn't accept um give images so i have to edit this particular image and it works well for me anyway so depending on you guys depending on what you want to achieve uh you can use any one you choose and so for this video i already copied the video to this section so i need a background for it i'm going to select that as a background and i'm going to look for the image i think this is the image and then just click on open so it will be imported first of all let me put in my background and then it's going to ask me for a size. I'm just going to leave this as default. So I think it's okay. Now I have to bring in our animation. So let me make it as long as the animation. And if I click play, you can notice it's playing. So let me just go ahead and remove the background. Just go ahead and select the image. Click on more option and click on visual property. Guys, note that if you are using a different video editor, it's going to be different for you. So like I said, if you are using Adobe Premiere Pro, no need for you to be going through this process. So just click on remove background and you can notice nothing happens. The reason is because the default color is selected as green screen. So go ahead and change this green screen to the default color like the one on our stage. Now you can notice that it's gray, but um, you can still select the color. That is if you pick the right color. But if you choose the wrong color, this will happen. So all you need to do is to go ahead and edit that color a little bit. See, if you get the accurate result, but if you don't get it, just select a default color that is light white. I think this actually did it for me. Um, before this video, guys, when I was editing this stuff, I actually took, I did a lot of, um, I did a lot of editing before I was able to come to this. But if you guys don't have time for that, you can just keep on. If not, you can go ahead and choose different colors to see how this actually affects your workflow. But in the long run, this is actually going well. So I'm just going to increase the tolerance and then leave this at default and increase the softness of the image a little bit. Just make sure that you still have your shadow on and you can notice the eye section. Make sure your eye is still displaying. So if you guys can just go ahead and try this several ways to see if it fixes it for you. But if not, just go ahead and play around it. But all in the long run, we are able to achieve this and it's looking clear enough. This is just what I want to show you guys. So this is just how to remove your background on your video. And if this video helped you guys, please don't forget to subscribe below, smash the like button and leave a comment below if you have any question. I'll be seeing you guys on my next video. So if you guys have any questions, please leave it on the comment section. I'll hopefully um, be able to attend to that um, very quick and very easy. So see you guys soon on my next video and stay home and stay safe. Peace.